So right, so for today we are going for the numerical differentiation. So first of all, we go through about what is the content about the numerical differentiation for this chapter. So for this chapter, the contents we have the first order derivative and also the second order derivative formula. We are going to detail it later. So each of the formula we have the forward, backward, centers formula, and you will go to discover what is different from the uh, of each of the formula here. So before we just start, so this is the first thing I want to introduce something. First of all, why we need the numerical differentiation. So do you think about this, why we are using the numerical differentiation? Why we don't want to do the differentiations automatically that we did on the calculus subjects? Okay, take a look on this one. So let's say you have this equation and you're going to differentiate this one. I know this is very easy. You can just differentiate this one. Of course, you can be easily get the values for the particular derivative. So, so what happens in let's say these uh, formulas or the functions getting more complex? Do you think it's easy for that to do the differentiation? Well, maybe you need some time to do this. And maybe it's quite complicated when you try to solve this. Yeah. So another reason is something like this. If you have a, a set of data, you want to do something like which one is moving faster. I mean, let's say you have two cars is moving and you want to know which one is moving faster. Maybe the data is given something like the telemetry, like this one. There is no equation, there is no anything. Just have, we just have the formulas, we just have the data points, and the time and the distance. So it is possible to get a speed. And how we know which one is moving is faster? And how fast is it? So that's why this is the reason why we need the numerical differentiation. 